boy, my boy, Devi TV. It's Wave God and this motherfucker. Hey, shout my nigga, Demi Tito. Got song pop like I'm Iggy. All they talking about is last night like I'm Demi. Say you got it. Roofies donated $5. Damn ski pulled the Back with another CJ the Jump video, you feel me? And today is Sakuna is a dog. The most disrespectful moments in anime history part five, you feel me? He back at it again with the most disrespectful anime, you feel me? And last time it was what's it? It was Yujiro, I think it was. And go check that reaction out if you want to, then you feel me. And if you're new to the channel, like, comment, subscribe, and share the video on all social media and comment below. What reaction you want me to do next? Check out the original video in the description box below. Roll to 100k a million and the bill. So click that subscribe button. Let's bring that as a family, as a nation. And no further ado, let's get into the reaction, man. So he brings this. the Jutsu Kaisen fans that check in. And some of y'all didn't subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. Man to the fight. So then he says, all right, my boy, class is in session. Today we will be learning how to beat an ass 101. I would like to thank our volunteer right here. Uh, I don't even know his name, but he will be used as a demonstration today. I beg your pardon. That's kind of fucked up. His name, um, Gojo need a more disrespectful moment. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, it is finally time for another installment of the most disrespectful moments in anime history. The series that we observe some of the most outrageous, most outlandish moments to ever be seen by the human eye. That just make you look at the screen like, well, goddamn, what did they do to make them face that mad? So, without further ado, roll them. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, first up to the plate is Sukuna being a dog. So Itadori and Fushiguro are fighting this ugly ass boy. What the f*** is that? Jesus Christ, bro. That is just ugly. So Itadori tells Fushiguro, I right, listen, bro. I'm just gonna have to let that dog come out. So Sukuna... like one of the ugly things on this fly kid movies. Sukuna comes out and he's like, hey, what's good with you, cuz? So the curse bags up and he's like, ah, oh, hell no. Nah. Who is this thug ass nigga? So then he starts talking to him like, boy, I tell you, boy, you ugly as sh The f*** you supposed to be a fish? A barnacle nigga? So he jumps back and starts charging up. Is that a Hadouken? Oh, <laughs> but he just stops it with one hand. Huh? And he looks at him and says, You ugly lip motherfucker. <laughs> Boy, I out of. That's literally what he said, but yeah, clap this nigga. Beat him. your ass. So now he's just face planting him into the ground. Then he starts looking at him like, Damn, cuz the fade just started and your ass already on the ground. Nigga, you best get your sorry ass up. Yo, dog stepped on him. So then he tries to grab him, but he rips his arm off. Who said, damn, boy, that gorilla grip done backfired on your ass. <laughs> and yo, he is no laughing while he is doing this. Yeah, he rip his arm. He tried to rip his leg off and rip his arm. Well, that's tough. So later on, while he is continuing to torment this thing, the curse comes down and starts laughing at him. So then he starts looking at him like, go, why you got that big ass grin on your face? You think shit is sweet or something? Goof ass, boy, I'll show you what's sweet. So then he hits him with the domain speech. Like a cotton knees on me, me like, back out now. Hello, can you hear me, nigga? But then he gets no response, so he's like, uh, So, about a minute later, he pops up right behind Fushi Girl. So, he's like, What's good, cut? Just to let you know, I'm about to beat your ass. But before I beat your ass, I'm gonna eat this crusty ass finger. Mm -mm -mm. The flavors are melting on my tongue. Wish I had a little bit of salt on it, though. I ain't gonna lie to you, my boy. Now, Time to beat your ass. So Fushi Girl starts swinging, but look at this man. He is weaving all of his punches. Leave his hands in his pockets. Oh, no. Nah. He was out, I got it. He was, he was, he was, um, dodging, dodging him like he was out here, um, salsa dance. Oh, bro. That's how you know you're done with it. You don't even want to take his hands out. So he saw him punch him. So Sukuna's like, damn, boy, you can't hit shit. Come on now, put your back into it. Oh, boy, gave him the backhand of the century. So Fushi Girl trying everything. He trying to jump him with the snake, the owl. He just eating it. Oh, my God. 
So then he comes back down, grabs him, and he says, come on now, there's a whole world out there we got to see, nigga. Yo, bro, check this whole body. He said, a whole new. like a fucking, like a fucking freezer. The world. Then bro starts playing ping pong with him. Ooh. Bro said, come on now, get your sorry ass up. So uh, as this man is flying through the buildings, the owl comes in and picks him up. He right behind him, and he like, boy, that ugly ass knocked out, set your ass down. Finish. God, that beating didn't even make any sense. He just beat this man for, just, for absolutely no reason at all. Yeah, <laughs> oh my God, yo, this man is disgusting. Yeah, when the rest of this manga gets animated, Homeboy is most definitely getting a full video. No, 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 listen, listen. No, 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 listen, listen. No, 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 no. Is most definitely getting a full video. All right, ladies and gentlemen, next up on the list is Gojo's PowerPoint presentation. So while bro is on the way to go meet the principal, he tells the driver, yo, stop the car. So as the dude leaves, he says, all right, you could come out now. So then this ugly ass boy come from the top rope. Then dog said, what's good, nigga? Get ready to become a pack. So he start throwing out everything. Bro threw some fat ass mosquitoes at him. He came from the side and made him Ghost Rider. And then he decided to hit him with a gut check. So then after all that, Bro is squeaky clean. He has taken no right, damage at all. So Volcano Head like, huh? <laughs> what type of hex you got? So then Gojo's like, you realize you cannot hit me, right? So then he says, come here. Don't be shy. Come a little closer. Touch my hand. So he tries to touch his hand, but he can't. Dog's so like, huh? The f*** is this? So then Gojo's like, you feel that? This is called my infinity, a.k.a. my plot armor. So do you want to know what you are, buddy? You're fodder. Bro, <laughs> gut check the life out of this man. Yeah. The dog said, hold on, I ain't even done yet. Bitch. I gotta go watch your Jujutsu Kaisen. Oh my god. Oh, hi -ya! <laughs> then he says, oh, you really thought you was gonna sneak me and get away with it? <laughs> Fuck out of my face. Oh, shoot. Oh my god, dog sent the flying in. Look at him, he dragging that shit down. I was like, get your bum ass out of my sight. Look at him, he dragging his dirty ass through the ground. He tries to hit him with a gallic gun. Then he cuts him behind and he's like, well, if you don't sit your poop ass down. <laughs> oh my god, bro is gone. So then Gojo's like, oh, this is a perfect time. So this man leaves, goes and sees Itadori, and he's like, yo, do you want to watch me beat this nigga's ass? <laughs> so he brings this man <laughs> to the I fight. So then he said, it's all right, my boy. Like, anime, like, I never know what he's like, oh. You want me to go? You want to come watch and beat, beat someone ass so you can get some lunch, lunch or something? I think I never seen that. In Class is in session. Oh. Today we will be learning how to beat a nigga's ass one on one. I would like to thank our volunteer right here. Uh, I don't even know his name, oh, but yeah, he will yeah, be used yeah. as a demonstration yeah. today. I beg your pardon. So then dogs like you mother. F hey, stop playing with my name, nigga. But then go just like <laughs> your name, buddy. You are weak. You're trash. I bet you half of the people that watch this show don't even know your name. That's fact. I don't even know who he is. To be honest with y'all, I don't even remember his name either. Hold on, hold on. Let's look him up real quick. Volcano Head and JJK. Jugo? Jogo? Yeah, let's just go with Jugo. All I know is he looked like Squidward when he had the volcano on his head. But anyways, bro got pissed. He was like, stop playing with my name. So then he uses his domain expansion and he done turned this bitch into Bowser's castle. So then Gojo's like, all right, Yuji, pay close attention. So bro takes off the blindfold and hits him with the domain expansion. Beautiful nigga void. <laughs> that beautiful nigga void. <laughs> so bro's like, oh, what is this? Pause. But who is this beautiful ass nigga? <laughs> then Gojo comes behind him and he's like, you know, man, it sucks being ugly. Trust me, I get it. Well, actually, I don't get it. <laughs> God, beautiful. <laughs> but uh, let me put you out of your misery. <laughs> Bro, he just ripped his head off with one hand, and to add to the disrespect, he stomped on his head. Like, dog, the fact that he basically used this man as a punching bag to be an example after he just tried to sneak him, and he left mid-fight? Exactly. Bro, that's disgusting. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, our next yeah, moment is one. more JJK. This actually would have been a Jujutsu Kaisen special if the last one wasn't JJK. But anyways, yeah, Toto beating the yeah. absolute breaks off of Fushiguro. Now, you see, this moment isn't just disrespectful. Nah, this is also one of the most down, bad, horrendously moments to ever exist. So, Toto and Mai pull up and they talking mad shit. 
My said, heard your classmate died. Tell me, how hard did that pack hit? Damn. So then Toto walks up to Fushi Girl and he says, Hey, boy, what's your type? Depending on the answer that you give me will determine if I beat the shit out of you or not. What? <laughs> Bro, what are you talking about? <laughs> this has to be one of the most wildest things I've ever heard come out of somebody's mouth. This is determined to run this man's fade if he does not like the exact same girls that he likes. So then he's like, come on now, speak up. How you like him, nigga? I like him tall with a fat ass, boy. Come on now, I ain't waiting all day. So he's like, I, right, uh, as long as she has good character, she's a 10. <laughs> so then Toto's like, damn, bro. You got bad taste. Huh? So he blesses this man. Good God, the clothesline from hell. Then he walks up to him and says, I knew it. Just by first glance, you a bitch ass nigga. So Fushi Girl pulls out these frogs, but Pro Flash them and takes them to Suplex City. <laughs> so then he starts pummeling them. He's like, fight back, nigga. You got bad taste and you saw it. So then he grabs his face and slams him into the wall. He's like, hold on, little boy. I ain't done yet. He starts lifting this man to play in so he's like, come on now, fight back, little boy. So as he's about to hit him again, Toge has to come in and hit him with the chill out, chill out. <laughs> then Panda come in and he like, yo, what are y'all doing? Then Toto says, his taste is trash. Let me beat his ass. But he's like, ah, forget it. But next time I see your chest, your taste better change, boy. Yo, the fact that this man Toto almost beat this man Fushi Girl to death because his taste in woman is bad. Like, uh, what? <laughs> Bro basically took your wife who is trash to the extreme. I, I, I'm just at a loss for words. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, our final moment. Probably, if not, one of the most disrespectful moments in anime history. Perfect Cell violating Vegeta. Lord have mercy, what can I say about this one? This needs no explanation. But you know what? First of all, these two buffoon ass niggas. Let's start off with this cocky bastard. That Saiyan Pride really had to kick in in full gear, huh? Bro, really let this man go absorb 18. And he was attacking Trunks, the only person with common sense during this entire moment. Yeah, dog, bro. You deserve to get your ass handed. Facts. Like, that shit was blew my mind. Oh, and don't think I forgot about this yeah. bald bastard. Damn. You had one job, but you got one little smooch, one little puck <laughs> on the cheek, and you was whipped into some cyborg coochie. Bro said, fuck the earth, she bad as hell. Man, oh man, did these decisions come to bite y'all in the ass. So after Cell absorbed 18 and became perfect, bro is just glorified by himself. Man, this is on Narcissus level 100. <laughs> and look at Vegeta, dumbass. Wow, he looks less intimidating. God, I thought we already learned this lesson with Frieza. When they look less intimidating, they're strong as f***. So then Krillin goes in and attacks this man. And bro ain't even paying him any attention. Man's like, wow, 18 really had him in the hands. <laughs> but Trunks came in and started attacking him. And he is still paying them no attention at all. Then he ate the Destructo disc. Then he turns around and he's like, so you want to play little nigga? <laughs> all right, then. Witness perfection. Look at him, he's skipping to him. Then he gets up in his face and he's like, boo. Then bro breaks his neck. And he is out cold. And look at him, he's like, ugh, weak ass nigga. 16, you wanna do something? Yeah, that's right, stay your big ass right there. So then here comes Vegeta. So he's like, all right, I see you got that perfect jawline and everything now. So you ready to scrap? Then Cell says, ugh, I guess you'll be a decent warm up. So Vegeta just starts throwing everything on. Bro is just blocking it. Bro's like, my, my prints are gonna have to do a little more than that to make me try now. So then Vegeta hits him with this kick and he's like, yeah, I did that. Cell's just looking at him like, really? Trash ass boy. So yeah. Vegeta's like, huh? What is this? And Cell's just laughing at him like, <laughs> and you came up with that corny ass name called Super Vegeta. Now let me show you how to throw a kick. So he kicks the life out of this man. Look at him, he's flying through mountains. And then he just falls into the ocean. So Cell just starts talking. He's like, wow, you was talking all that good shit a second ago. Now look at your sorry ass. So then Vegeta Literally how Cell was. Uh, personally, my favorite attacking enemy. He starts charging up the final flash. And Cell is just standing there watching him do it. Bro's looking at him like, man, you're putting on a great light show, buddy. This rival's Dizzy Wolf fireworks show. So then Vegeta just starts calling to him. Cell, you f ass, f ass nigga. If you think you hot, then stay your ass right there. So Cell's like, I oblige. So then Vegeta hits him with the final flash. He's like, oh my god. Oh. <laughs>
That's how I was for real, for real. Still to this day, I wonder, what poor planet did that blast end up landing on? So everybody's like, oh my god, he's done it! Father's done it! So he blew off half of Cell's chest. So Cell says, ugh, he actually hit me, damn it! So Vegeta's like, yes, I did it! I am him! So Vegeta keeps on laughing. Cell says, stop laughing, damn it! Like, for real, stop laughing. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bro. It's just a look on his face that gets me every time. So it says, did you forget that I had Piccolo Cells as well, you dummy? So then Vegeta just losing it. He just starts spamming people. But well, we all know. When Vegeta resorts to using this spam key blast move, oh, it's over. So Cell just walks through it and just slaps him. So he kicks him to high heaven and hits him with the spike. Oh, oh Grass, I went to college. <laughs> Grass. <laughs> well, that was the most disrespectful moments in anime history five. Basically. The JJK special with a little DBZ down in there. I will have a poll on my Twitter and my IG later to see if y'all want homie right here on the table. I could either add him now or wait till the next arc gets animated, which I've already read. Wait till the next arc. Ready, read, by the way. So we'll decide that on the other platform. Because you gotta add Gojo to the table. Once, but uh, hope y'all enjoy. Make sure to sub to the second channel. Follow you one. Hope you guys like that. Dean Fan, Dean Nation. Like, comment, subscribe, and share the video on all social media and comment below what reaction you want you missed. See you guys next time. Love you guys.